What's up everybody? Jeremy here with Backcountry and Beyond and today I have a new product I'd like to introduce you to. Um, if you're looking to infuse your food with some awesome smoke flavor, we got what you need. As you guys may already know, we're all about that great wood-fired flavor here at Backcountry and Beyond. Um, we're all about the Traegers and we're all about giving you the tools that you need to get that flavor in your food. So this is our newest addition to the product lineup this is the amazing smoker tube so even if you don't own a traeger and you're looking to get some of that awesome wood fired flavor in your food we've got the tool for you right here so maybe you're cooking on a gas grill and you've never tried smoking your foods before this could be a great introduction for you um, if you've got a charcoal grill um, even if you're using like an electric smoker um, you know wood chips can be kind of a pain in the butt sometimes this will make your life a lot easier this takes wood pellets you just fill this up with wood pellets light it off stick it on the grill and let it smoke this is the 12 inch smoke tube this will give you up to four hours of smoke on one fill even if you've already got a Traeger and you're just wanting a little bit more smoke flavor in your food this is going to help you get that smoke flavor a little bit heavier a little bit faster um, or maybe you're cooking a chicken at 375 and you're not really getting any smoke at that temperature we'll throw this bad boy on there and you could be smoking at 375 maybe you want a cold smoke maybe you've got a couple blocks of cheese that you want to smoke you can't smoke cheese at 165 degrees you can smoke it with this though you just turn the grill off just leave the grill turned off throw this sucker on there put you some cheese on the grill you can cold smoke some cheese um, so we've got two options for you this is the 12 inch smoke tube you fill this all the way up with pellets it's going to get you about four hours of smoke um, and then we also have the expandable tube this one can be 12 inches or 18 inches so with this one fully expanded and full of pellets you're gonna get up to six hours of smoke out of this one. These things are awesome. I've been trying it out at home. Some of the other guys have been trying it out. Um, we're all pretty pleased with it so far. So without further ado, we're gonna get right into it. We're gonna show you how to light this thing, how to use it, and we're gonna see how long we can get this thing to smoke on our Ironwood 885 here. All right, so here I have our 12 inch smoke tube as you can see we've used this one a couple of times so yeah we've definitely been trying it out um, I've got it full all the way to the top I've got some signature blend pellets in here that's a blend of uh, hickory maple and cherry wood and I'm gonna show you how to get this thing started so you're gonna need a torch you can pick up a uh, torch starter kit just like this for about 16 bucks at Walmart uh, you're definitely gonna need a torch if you try to light this thing with a lighter you're gonna be standing here all day so don't even bother just go ahead and get a torch it's gonna to make your life a lot easier and of course exercise caution go ahead and get your torch going and you're just gonna light off the top of these so we're just gonna hold this on here and you're gonna to want to hold this torch for probably about a minute you want to go ahead and, and hold it there for a little while and make sure that you've got this thing lit really well All right, so as you can see, it's lit. We got a pretty good flame going. Now, you're gonna wanna let it sit and burn for probably about eight, maybe 10 minutes before you do anything with it. You wanna make sure that you've really got it going well because the last thing you wanna do is put your Boston Bud or whatever on the grill and then have this thing go out on you and have to relight it. So just take the extra time and make sure that you've got it going really well before you put it on the grill. So we're gonna let this go for about eight minutes and then we'll come back to it. All right, so it's been about 10 minutes. As you can see, we're rolling pretty good here. Still got a nice flame. This thing's about ready to go. Oh yeah, she's good. So again, please exercise caution. You are literally playing with fire here. So be careful, don't touch the top of this thing. It's gonna be really hot. Um, we do sell some uh, high temp heat resistant grilling gloves here at the store too so that's something to consider but uh, at this point we're ready to throw this thing on the grill 
But first, you want to go ahead and blow this flame out. You want your pellets to smolder and smoke. You don't want them on fire at this point. So, there we go. Good to go. And look at that beautiful smoke. You probably can't even see me through that cloud of smoke. So, all you got to do now, just lay this right on the grill grates. And that's it. I mean, you don't have to touch this thing for hours. It's just going to sit there and smoke. It's going to flavor your food. If you've got a downdraft grill, like the uh, Ironwood or the Timberline, you can set this wherever you want. That uh, downdraft convection is really going to circulate that smoke really well. Um, if you've got a Pro Model grill with a chimney on it, put your smoker tube on the opposite side of the chimney. So if you've got the previous model that has the chimney on the right side, put your smoker tube on the left. That way that smoke has to travel across the entire cavity of the grill before it exits out the chimney. So if you got one of the newer Wi-Fi or Pro model grills, your chimney's on the left, put your smoker tube on the right. So that's it, it's uh, 10.45 a.m. We just put this fully loaded smoker tube on the grill. Should get us up to four hours of smoke. We're gonna come back and check it every hour and we'll see just how long we can get this thing to smoke on our Ironwood 885 today. All right, it's been exactly one hour and I don't know how well you guys will be able to see this on the camera, but there is loads of smoke rolling out of this grill right now. Let's open it up and see how this smoker tube is looking. Looking good. Looks like we burned up about a quarter of the pellets in that tube. So at that rate, we should be right on track to get about four hours of smoke out of this thing. And uh, we'll come back and check it again in an hour. It's been a full four hours and as you can probably see this thing is still going strong there's our smoker tube it's been four hours and there's enough pellets in there to smoke for at least another half an hour so the manufacturer claims you will get up to four hours of smoke out of this 12 inch tube I would say they're definitely not lying about that if anything they're being a little bit conservative so yeah that's the uh, amazing smoker tube i don't know about you guys but i think it's pretty amazing so come to the store and check these out we've got these available in the 12 inch size as well as the 12 to 18 inch expandable tube uh, if you can't make it to the store these are available on the website and they are available to ship as well just hop on backcountryandbeyond.com type smoker tube in the search bar at the top of the page it'll take you right to it so yeah, that's about it guys. I hope everybody's staying safe out there. We'll catch you later.